the river, it perceived all the people who the one was in it. I have delivered, delivered to you. Abram is name. When Abram was ninety-nine years old, the Lord appeared to him and said, I am the Almighty God. Walk in my way and be perfect. I will make my covenant with you and your people shall increase greatly. Abraham kneeled down his face to the ground and God talked to him saying, My covenant I shall keep with you no longer. You be gone, Abraham, from you shall many be descendants. Your name shall be called Abraham, Abraham. For I have made you a father of many nations. I will keep my covenant with you, and my covenant shall be in blessings with you. And you descendant, you in descendant, in blessing with you, and you descendant through all the regions, your line shall prosper, and from it shall arise nations and kings to you and to them. I will give you the land of Canaan, in which you are a stranger. As an in blessed days, passion, and I will be there, dear God. As for Sarah, your wife, you shall call her no longer Sarah, but her name shall be called Sarah. I will bless her, and from her you shall have a son. She shall be a mother of nations and of a king. Abraham bowed down and laughed to him, saying to himself, saying, Can a man hundred, can a man hundred years old have a son? And Sarah, a woman of ninety, can have a child? Then God said, Sarah, your wife, shall bear a son, and you shall call him by the name Isaac. With him and with his children at the end, when I make my investing government. I hear with me, and I have come to pass that when Abraham was sitting in the door of his tent in the, in the place of horror, the Lord appeared to him in the form of the three angels in the head of the day. Abraham raised his eyes and saw three men standing before him. He ran to meet them and bow the ground, saying, My Lord, if I have found favor in the sight, do not pass away. I beg you, from your servant, let a little water be pushed, be forced, and wash your feet, and wash your feet, and rise, and rest. And raise yourself under the tree. I will bring bread to refresh you in comfort. Your heart, then you may go on your way. Then they say to him, Do as you have said. So Abraham asked them into the tent where Sarah his wife was, and said, Quickly, make three measures of, of fine meal, kill it, 
and bear it upon the heart that he ran to the all and produce a good tender call and and give it to a young man to perform Abraham then took butter and milk and the hoof and the set the food before men he stood by them under the tree while they eat what is Sarah your wife they are in there is her son he said one of the men said Sarah your wife shall have a son Sarah is standing in the tent door way behind him earth this she and Abraham were old and they were beyond the tent for having children Sarah therefore now to himself then God said to Abraham why did Sarah now say she is too old to have a child is there is there anything is there anything anything the Lord cannot do at the appointed time Sarah shall come a son shall have a son Sarah denied that she had now for she was afraid afraid but God said no you did not the Lord did as he had promised and Sarah bare Abraham a son in his old age at the time chosen by God and Abraham all the sons Isaac a name which means he will die. Welcome, welcome to Beyond King. It is welcome to Beyond King. It is a name. A name. Are you with me? A name. He will die. At the beginning, he had the age that God has spoken, not Jesus, that God has spoken, not Abraham, that God has spoken, not Mormon, that God has spoken, not David, that God has spoken, not I, I. He will love a name and you have right to ask them whatever they are to ask them and ask God on your behalf since they have seen the sun before you You have run. You have tried on the own and is not taking place. Mention any of them to ask God Himself on your behalf. Then you using them as God. Hey, share and subscribe. Share and subscribe. Abraham vision. Abraham vision. Abraham vision.